Hello. 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 <laughs> Ellen doesn't like when I say hello, hello. I think it's fine. I just know it's you do it every time. Ellen thinks I'm weird. I'm not weird. Oh my gosh. You know what Randy did just do, though? Oh boy. There we go. drop. <laughs> I'm not kidding when I say this. Every game that we play, Randy drops pieces. Every game. Usually they're down by me, so I have to, like, I'll see you guys later. <laughs> Every single game. Hi, guys. I mean, it is hard to drop pieces. <laughs> like, you know, you're perfect. You never drop any pieces, mm -hmm. but Very you perfect. rarely, you rarely put games to up, so. <laughs> no. <laughs> Hola. <laughs> oh. Hi, Leon. Panic. Hi, Nathan. Hello, 47. Let's pitch in and get chatting. That's Let's right. Do Let's it. get do chatty. It. Getting, um, all, getting all chatty. Um, sound check, if yeah. you don't mind, because we did Oops. have to rearrange some stuff again. <laughs> yes, yes, again. Audio is great. You should get into the audio business because it's a fun endeavor. <laughs> Let me tell you how much sleep Randy's gotten this last week because of sound issues. What? How many hours? Realistically, how many hours of sleep do you think you got this week? Because you were up working on the uh, sound up until like one or two, even some 2 mornings. Two thirty, yeah, the other day. Not, not a lot. <sighs> so calculator on the table. This is my, this is my. Um, um, hey, that's Isaac. what I used to switch camera angles. We're fancy like Usually that. it's kind of off the screen, but I guess I'm, I guess we're shooting wider than we usually do. I guess we are. And also our monitor is lower, so I'm having to keep yes. it before. It was like wired here and now. Yeah. It's it kind of nice. It makes more sense. Um, Before we get started with Orleans, <coughs> Orleans. Orle well, I wanted to tell you guys that I got this little ditty over here for my coffee. Because every single time we play down here, like it's a cold basement. And my coffee gets freezing, and then I chill, can't drink it. Chill. So I finally bought a coffee warmer, and I'm testing it out tonight. So far, <laughs> it could be hotter, but <laughs> audio <laughs> sounds good. Thank warmer. you guys for letting us know on that. Mm. Um, yeah, a little. I know we've been doing yeah. a lot of uh, like tabletopia in that. So real pieces. These are. This is not a hologram, folks. These are real pieces. This is real. We're gonna, <laughs> this is going to get real crazy. This is real music. Yeah, panic. It's been really crazy with sound stuff. Yeah, I don't so know. So annoying. Well, it's there was that one major thing that happened, which I don't know what. I mean, literally, I did nothing, and like everything was like yeah, everything up. was messed up, and we did nothing. I feel like something got like reverted back to an original state or something somehow. I don't know. Yeah. But then I've been kind of tweaking it since then because I took a different way of um, setting it up because mm -hmm. it's it's really it's a better way of having it set up, but it's it's a little more finicky. So it took a little while to get it all together. And to yeah. kind of adjust things and figure things there out. There was the and... night though that he was up at two thirty in the morning. It, I, I just kept hearing, "Hello, hello, is this working? How is this working?" <laughs> and it would be booming through the floorboards. I finally just put my earbuds in and went to sleep, like <laughs> listening to bird sounds. <laughs> um, Nathan, my hair is not different, but it's in a p -p -p ponytail. P -p -p ponytail. <laughs> this is cute song that comes on, and I can never wear ponytails without Randy singing it. I never wear ponytails. I feel a little bit like a horse. But <laughs> I think, I think you're a magnificent. You're supposed to say it, think you're a magnificent steed. <laughs> I'm a magnificent beast. <laughs> oh, oh Leon. <laughs> <laughs> All, All right. right. Yeah, panic. It's sound is. Hey, Leon. I don't know why, but hopefully the sound will come out better than ever. Um, we did go through great lengths to make things um, a little bit better. So yes, Tim, good to see you. Oh hi, Tim. So Rand and I have like we've been playing this. What is this our fourth game already? We just got it or third? Is it fourth? I think it's third. I think it's our third game since okay. we're buying it. Like which a, is like a week ago. Yeah, huge playing that many times. Yeah, this caliber of. We also game. played Viticulture what twice? Twice. Oh, <laughs> Viticulture. So we well, those I are both it. games that we've played I'm in the past it. a number of times, but we um, did not own those two games. Right. And we remedy that situation. You did. We're, well, we're a team, Ellen. So anything I do, you do. <laughs> Gosh, is that how that works? Somebody, we sold some of our games from our calling that we've been doing. 
And yeah. is it the day you got the money? How long uh, have you been waiting for that? Oh, uh, I didn't wait for the money because oh. I knew it was coming the next day, so I bought it. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. Anyway, yeah, we sold a whole bunch of games. Hi, like, Tony. We sold like what five games, and then we bought. Well, four games and a couple expansions, and I bought three games and a couple expansions, and it only cost me an extra thirty bucks. So rationalization. The money column is going back, you know, towards the red, <laughs> but the games is going towards the black. We have less games, so. That's right. So forty-seven that. loves the top knot. Thank you. I feel like I. <laughs> also, my hair is growing in super white on the sides, which I feel is really cool. It's my superpower. Cool. Um. Hello, Patricia. To- oh, hi, Patricia. Good to see you. Tony wants to know how we decide what games to stream. Literally whatever what suits feel our like. fancy. It's whatever I feel like. I never make promises. And yeah. it's just because I have to be in the mood to play it. For our guest plays that we've been doing, but yeah, that we um, we've been hey, definitely Ryan, planning those. Or... The ones that we've been doing on like Thursdays. Hey, James. So. <laughs> yeah, we got well, this game. Good deals. And right. then, like, Mr. A... Hudson. Good to see you, Mr. sir. Mr. Hudson. <laughs> okay. Randy got this game. And then like a day later, it was, I think, 15 bucks cheaper, which is... Yeah, significant when you got four mouths to feed being diapers. Sale. Diapers to buy. Mm. <laughs> significant. Orleans <laughs> is the greatest of all time. It's one of the greats of all time. So one O O G O A T. Can I tell you? I had no idea what that meant. I was like, it's an animal. I the greatest of all time is, of course, Feast for Odin. <laughs> oh, Feast for Odin. <laughs> Leon, my studio is in shambles because I continued painting, causing the whole thing to be filled. <laughs> yeah, that happens. That happens. All right, everyone. Hey, Shane. This is a, you know, I, I say older game, you know, in, in board game terms, this is, this game's practically ancient these days. Yeah. Right. Seriously. <laughs> but this game is, um, I mean, I wouldn't call it a classic yet. It's not old enough, but this eh, will definitely, I, I think this will definitely be one of the uh, classic games yep. of the golden age of yes, board games. This game ain't going nowhere. Oh, this is going to fall over. That's why I have that box behind it. Yeah. Well, then the box looks ugly on the screen. So. So let's lay the box down instead. Let's do it. Problem not solved. You made it worse. I made it worse? Shoot. Whatever. Shoot. All right. It's in top five. Yeah. It's honestly, and this is, that's what I like. That's what I like about this game a lot is that you play it and you're instantly like, "Hmm." oh, like you instantly know this is going to be like a favorite of yours. Now, obviously some people aren't going to like it and that's fine. But like the people that like it, you can tell like the first game you're like, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> There's a handful of games that after the first couple like turns that I took, you just sit there and you're like, that was incredible. I could do this next time. And it just gets so, I lo- oh. So Nathan <laughs> says he knows nothing about this game, so he can't help us. And oh, that Nathan. Is a, that's a shame, yeah. Nathan. Because no, I depend on you. You know we need the help. That's your job in life, <laughs> is to come here and remind me to move my pieces and to do stuff. Uh, oh, hi, David M. <laughs> last dance. Oh, good. All right, let's tell the people about this. Uh, are you the only one that doesn't hate the box cover? Uh, Shane, I do not hate any box covers because I don't care really that much. I definitely appreciate a good box cover, and I yeah, would say this difference. one is not one of the better ones, but I don't hate it because I, I, mean, I don't it, think I've ever said I hate a box cover. I that's just true. feel like that's like whatever, but you Roger do that. really appreciate ones that you appreciate. <laughs> Um, the, this blue dude in the middle. Uh, Panic, my back Panic to Games, you are going to get the boot, Mr. Panic Games. This game is not pretty good. It's oh, dang Panic good or God. higher. It's either dang, it's you got, you got pretty good, it's either dang good, really good, or extremely good, or the best of all time. Or goat. So you're way too low on the um, good scale. Panic is here for sass, and we all know that. It's here to be sassy. <laughs> sassy and saucy. So we will give you an overview of Orléans. Orléans. Or, Orléans. 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 Something like that. I don't know. I'm not very good at pronunciations, and I overdo most of them for comedic effect. So this is Orléans, or Orléans. Just, oh my gosh. Orléans. This is literally 50% of what we say when we play this game. (laughs) We just take our term like Orléans. It's what's inside, not the cover. I I heartily agree. That's true. Uh, All right, so this is Orléans, and this is a bag building game. If you've not heard of that term, it is kind of like a deck builder. So, um, yes. you know, in a traditional deck builder, you have a certain amount of tiles at the very beginning of the game. And in this case, we have these four.
colors, there are a few others. So we have the red, which are knights, and we also have the yellow, which are monks. Now, yellows are completely wild. They can be used as any color. And the knights are not wild, but they're just another thing that you can use on your board. Hi, Chrissy. And so what we mean here by a bag builder and not a deck builder is that these tokens will all go in our little bags. And these bags, you'll pull out a certain amount of people and you'll be able to use those on your turn. So I pull these out and we start with the four right in front of us because everybody starts with the ability to draw four from their hand or from their bag. And from these their, will yeah. be able to get placed out onto these boards here. So these are our uh, boards. We all have the same boards. And these have like all these different spaces for them. Now, many of these spaces are really just ways of gathering more of the um, tokens on them. So like, for instance, if you go here, you'll get a blue, oh. a black, or a brown. You go over here, you get a white. You go over here, you get a red. This one up here gives you a gray. This one gives you, oh, this one gives you a yellow. I mean, this one gives you a gray. And the other ones are other things you could do. The ones at the top here are for moving around on this little map. So people said when you went to the camera view, the sound cut, so maybe you can't oh. use that. That's happened before with that camera. Interesting. Great. I might not have put that How back on How does this get there. compared to... each other all right so i know i know the sound cut out there guys so i am going to cut over to that and put the sign on sound on real quick is it still on there we go Yay. all right audio <laughs> fixed for some reason oh i had gosh, that off. The fun times yep see you know audio it's great yep it's great Great. Um, great. Somebody asked how it compares to Quacks, and I said I didn't, I wouldn't really compare them, except for that it's bag building. I feel the like bag this building, is, how bag building work is is, is the, same. the same, but yeah. everything else is different. And I put it as this game feels like Quacks, older, more sophisticated brother. That's what I called it. For yeah. Because yeah. you're, but but not really. Cousins. The bag they're building, cousins. yeah, they're yeah, they're cousins. They're brothers, but the cousins. the bag building part is is the same. Like you pull out a certain amount of. Those, that one's like a push your luck when you pull them out. This one, you can only pull out a certain amount as you pull true, them true, out. True, true, true. So there's that. Um, as you grab these gentlemen here, um, I, there, I don't believe there are any ladies in this game. I apologize. There are, uh, the farmers look like they could be ladies. Those are definitely women. Anyway. They're actually <laughs> working the hardest. When well. you grab these, you go up these certain tracks. So the white um, farmers here, you go up this track and you get the associated goods. Goods can be used in selling things along the path in this map. Thanks, Thomas. They also are worth victory points at the end of the game. The browns here, every time you go up on that, not only do you get a brown, but you're able to put a little wagon or a cog, cog. onto one of your spots. Which is fun to say also. You cover up that spot and forever for the rest of the game, you uh, do not have to place that color that you covered on your board. You can only put a maximum of one per um, action space. You can't put them on yellows. Uh, the black here is you can get these little buildings. So these are little personalized buildings that you can I do that um, give you different special abilities that only you can use. So here's some that give you like um, some goods. This one gives you some clothes, some coins and other ways of getting coins and all sorts of neat stuff in here. And there's level one and level two buildings where level two is generally better, right? But they're not always what you want exactly. You typically need a couple of level ones to kind of support your level two buildings and things like that. Um, we got the blue boatsman. This really just gives you coins. And coins in this game is actually important because yes. it's points. Yes. There's going to be a lot of these act, uh, events that come up that are going to tax us and be cruel to us and make us spend money. It's actually called torture, is it not? If you can't pay the coins, it's called torture, yes. And it feels like that because you work really hard to get these things and then you can't believe it's happening to you when you get things taken away or whatever, yeah, the, right. you know. The so coins are points. So every time you get coins, you are getting points. And then we get to these red guys here. This is how you get more tokens out of your bag at one time. Oh, so panic. That's not this will go from five, six, seven, and even eight tokens. And eight tokens is actually the most you could ever pull out of your bag mm -hmm. if you only have eight spaces on your board here. The grades here will let you go up. They're like scholars. They'll let you go up in this bottom track. This bottom track is a multiplier. You'll see these little citizen tokens. 
And so, and you also have these little guild hall tokens. So as you're moving around the board, you want to put some guild hall tokens in these little individual cities. And you count up your amount of guild halls you put out on the map, how many citizens that you've acquired from the different boards, and you multiply that by this large star number, large tuna star <laughs> number. So you might be able to large. see it a little bit here. This yeah. is a six, this is a five, a four, and a three. And that's your multiplier. So that multiplier is a huge way of getting points. I think I got like 50 points last game. Yeah, you did. Thank you for bringing that up. Like I was mad for or hours. 60 points, Ask Chrissy. I think, somewhere there. Yeah. But that's okay. So that's good to get up this track and do that. So grays are one of the main ways of doing that. There's also some buildings, etc. So this map right here, you can see there's different uh, waterways and wagonways. And that's how you move with these two different actions. You have the shipping and you have the wagon. And um, so you'll pick these up and then they're worth certain points. Grains are one, cheese is two, wine is three, and uh, wool is four, and brocades or brocades, brocades. Are, are five I'm points. Saying brocades. Now, in addition, Except we are playing with the trade and intrigue expansion in which it has a new rewards board, or you can play with an intrigue board that has a little bit more player interaction if, you, if that's your game. And then also these little like they're not trade routes, but they're like delivery cities, I guess. Mm -hmm. So these will tell you a certain amount of goods that need to be delivered to various places on the cities. And they're generally worth about <clears throat> twice, generally, about twice what the goods are. So if you have to deliver four cheeses, that's yeah. eight points. You know, it's going to be 16 or I can't higher. imagine playing this game without that, without those cards. Yeah, the Intrigue expansion really does um, kick it up a notch. Because this whole stack of events changes every round, mm -hmm. which is or every game, which is cool. Huge, yeah. uh, Nathan, does this take place in Orléans? It actually takes place in the countryside yes. of Orléans. So Orléans is where we start, and there's many cities around mm -hmm. it, like Le Mans, Le Mans, and I don't know what a lot of these other ones, Le Mans, and uh, Le Mans, Le Mans. I'm only, I'm only saying the ones that I kind of know. Just, you can embarrass yourself. Really? Nobody cares. <laughs> Le Mans. Yeah, that's um, so too. that is generally um, this game. Now, this board over here is you'll actually send people permanently out of your bag. So you paste them into this town hall area and they'll get permanently sent over to here to do various actions. This is one of the main ways of getting these citizen tiles and also just different ways of getting some of these things that your other guys do. Mm -hmm. So it is a way to weed down your bag because just like any good bag builder right. or deck builder, you want to you have a lean. you want to have it lean and not focused lean. on what you're trying to do. Right. Yes. And that is Orléans. So Ellen, you've given me the first player marker. Yep. Are you telling me that you want me to go first? That's not at all what I intended. Okay. How would you, you like to do you want to thumb wrestle? You want to choose? I'm not thumb wrestling you. you want to choose? Yeah. Your rock paper scissors. Uh, we'll do We'll do choose. I'll be choose? even. Choose? You're going to be even? Yeah. I'm always but how many do you get? Is it like a two out of three, out of three. thing? Okay. Yep. So one, two, three, shoot. Okay. One, two, two three, shoot. shoot. Me. Wait, one. wait, wait. I'm evens. You're evens? Yeah. Oh, I'm odds. Okay, fine. One, two, three, shoot. One, two, three, shoot. Just, uh, you're such a cheater. You're so predictable. <laughs> I couldn't think fast enough. My fingers were like, just oh. do the same thing. <laughs> the game has already been won. Oh, gosh. Oh. Ellen, Ellen, show off your iPhone case, please. Oh, I'd be happy to. Which camera are you? Yeah, doing? you can do it that way. So it has moving metallic beads. It's like a lava lamp. <laughs> it it makes a phone about twice as thick though. So it's ridiculous, but it's so pretty. Sometimes <laughs> Randy's like, "You're on your phone again," and I'm like, "Yep." And I'm just <laughs> looking at the marbles and rolling around. It's Best. All right, so I will go first, and we will reveal the first tile, which in trade and intrigue is always a sil sila. What is it called? Silentium. What does this remind you guys of? Come on, somebody has to think of this. Let's see. There you go. Focus. <laughs> <laughs> Here, give it to me. I can't handle my life. Okay, Ellen hey, wants to know what people hey, are reminded jumps. of this. It's so don't say it. Somebody write it in the chat. It and I will be so proud. Remind you of. They can think on it. Now I'm going to tell you the answer. Monty Python and the Holy Grail. 
right. So now that we've done that, a little funness. pre-game game. Jordan right. Schoenberger. Oh, he's here again. Gosh, that guy's like a stalker. <sighs> no matter how many times I've banned that man, I have literally finds a way past. Candace, and I'm like, can you just tell he him finds a way off? past the censors every time. <laughs> That's the Jordan Schoenberger censors. <laughs> <laughs> They're very expensive and hard to come by. <laughs> Monty Python, Panic got it. That's yes, right. Panic. You know, I'd like to play Altiplano. I hear but... a lot of people say that that one took this one's place in the hosh. All right, so the so. first thing that we do is um, reveal the thing, which we did, and now we can draw our followers, which we don't really do on the first scoring. one. And then this can be done simultaneously where we all place yes. out Biblios. I can see that too, Nerd Shells, yeah. That is very, <laughs> yep. Um, so we can all place our tokens out at the same time. Sometimes later in the game, it might matter who goes first. So you can actually say, hey, yes. we'll, we'll place our things out in player order. But honestly, most of the time it doesn't. What it really is matters is what Fruitness. people commit to over here. Because sometimes like Randy does, right, Chrissy? He was like looking at our board and trying to figure out where we're going to put our guy. Well, I'm and then he goes interactively first, like, playing. Are you serious? I'm interactively oh, playing. Oh, so Man. Does it remind me of Monk's? I would say that's accurate, too. All right. All right, let's do this thing. <sighs> you know, I don't want to do my, my typical move. I right do. Away, per se. Neat, neat, neat. <laughs> this, is, this is exactly what I'm That's what you like to do. Because I know you won't just... Um, oh, wait. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Yes, to me. 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 Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. What you gonna do? Are you done? There's three huh? pieces. Oh, and yeah. now I think Randy already never said this, but you don't have originally. to. You don't have to put pieces out until you're ready. That's correct. You probably already said that, didn't you? If I do this, though, I'm pulling less pieces, <laughs> but I'm going to. Oh, you did it. panic. So oh my gosh. All right. There's ready? some inappropriate parts in that movie, but it is hilarious. All right, so we carry out our actions. Now this is done in a. I take one action, Ellen takes one action, and we go back and forth until so you go. Things left. So, so I'm going to do the farmhouse farm action. Yeah, I'm going to do the farmhouse right away. Okay, okay. I want that coinage. <laughs> so I'll, I'll explain how that track works here also. There's another little thing that that works on there, and I'll explain that as we go along. Okay. Ellen. Uh, I'm doing the village. So Excellent I'll put these choice. back in here. I'm getting a brown dude. I don't really know what he's actually called. He goes in the bag. I think he's a craftsman. I get a cog. A cog. I go up on the track, but I have to put it on the farmer space. On any farmer space. Any farmer space first. Yes, ma'am. Nope. Yes. Oh, you want to get them red guys again. I mean, drawing you, people is You huge. like the red strategy. I do, and I didn't win last time. What am I doing? Hmm. Oh, hi, Heather. Notice me. Notice me. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, Heather has some Hello, awesome successful work. Geek. You guys should check it out. Uh, artwork. Hey, successful geek. All right, so we did that. Brown, Brown craftsman. See, I was yeah. right. Okay. Nailed it. Nailed it. Now we resolve the event. Event. Revent. Or Idiot. event. And so on this one, it does nothing. And then I pass the start player. Well, thank you. Down. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks. Thank you. I thank do you. this only because I must. <laughs> All right, ready? So yeah, I reveal so this. Yeah, so we reveal the next hour. And these time. happen at the end of the thing. I don't know what's called. Yeah, they... they um, so normally mm. the events all happen at the end, but with the trade and the intrigue, there are some events that will be triggered um, at different times during the round. So this one's called conference, and it's looking like you have to, you you're cannot, not allowed to do a university. You cannot hire them. You can't hire a university to do Which to this. Which is great. Oh, but you don't have to keep those there. Oh, you do? You locked them in before. I did. Sure. Why did you lock them in? I don't know, because I was thinking like it, it mattered. It was stupid. It was stupid. I'm going to take it back. No, no. So I, I can draw four, not up to four. I can draw four. That really actually stinks quite a bit. Babe, that's. I don't know why. I, why did I commit those? I was telling that's you, stupid. I'm like, that's odd. <laughs> that's stupid. I was like, that's dumb. Um, so I get a coin here because this track right here. So you um, do one coin for having the most farmers and then you get minus one for having the least. Yeah. But in a two player game, you don't get a penalty for the least, if I remember correctly. That's how we played last short time. On is that dude. Always short on the dang fisherman. Maybe I just need to get a dang fisherman. Better you die. Yeah. So it's only you don't um, normally if in a three or more player game the last place person would I lose one. Guess I think I'm done. Yeah, this is stupid of me. 
A dummy. Such a dummy idiot, as my kids would say. Dummy idiot. That's true. They say dummy idiot a lot. We're great parents. Yeah. But then we, then we kick them and tell them <laughs> not to do it. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, that craftsman's book comes. Are, you, right are we done? Now. I'm ready to go, bro. I'm ready. Bro, bro. Bro, 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 bro. Do you have two things you're doing? No. You know what? I don't want to do this, but I'm getting a fisherman. Fishermen are great. They're fine. Two coins. Ooh, I get two coins. Aren't you so great? All right, I am going to take the village action. I'm going like, to get a brown towner myself. Why is my hip? Am I 80? And I will get a cog. So the cogs don't actually go into effect until the next round. Right. Uh, but since we're basically not doing anything, I'm going to put it down right away onto the village. That's staying at a acceptable temperature. It's acceptable. acceptable. It, here's the line of returning it this to Amazon. This game is so bad. It makes me bleed. Here's so acceptable. <laughs> Wait, who hates this game? Oh. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Better just in case. <laughs> um, nerd shells. Yes. Yeah, sorry if you missed it. I don't think we said specifically, but yes, we have um, played with Create an Intrigue. I've played with it, I don't know, four times sure. now, and you play with it a couple. I introduced the game to Ellen with the Trade and Intrigue because there, it literally doesn't add hardly anything as what far are as doing complexity. Are you, are you done? Are you dropping yep, so it then already? we have to resolve the event. Oh, that's right. Oh, but that happens so, during the yes. round, so it's fine. So pass the start player token to me, to me, please. I accept the token from you. <laughs> Bless this thine holy token. I made a blow Oh, we have a harvest enemies. right away. So you have to get rid of one of those Great. items or, else or pay five, five coins. coins. That's what we mean by torture. <laughs> um, there's another Matt in this group. What's his name? Matt. Matt LeBlanc. There's a Matt, Matt Warmbier in here. Warmbier. Warmbier? I haven't played this. I need you. Yes, you need you. But no, there's another Matt in here. He said, I'm keen to play this. And the word keen made me go, where's he from? So if you're in the chat, I want to know where you're from, Matt. I don't know, know why that reminds me of like. I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't remind me of something I'd hear in Ireland. I don't know. Maybe I'm taking it wrong because I'm not going to yet. All right, there we go. I'm locked. I've locked in my lyrics. Uh, Stephanie, that is okay. We will let you. We will release you oh, no. from your duties Stephanie, of watching. You need to help me. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Stephanie. Thank you for being here. We will miss thee. Leon needs theme in a game. This has theme. Love Feast Froden and Castles of Burgundy. It's Monty Python. Um, I know. Think about it. I mean, you could. I don't know. Yeah, there's not. They uh, link up. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. It, it's pretty dry, I guess. I think that I'm. Oh, I forgot to get my extra coin. Ready? You, we sailed right past that. Okay. My coin. I think I'm ready. <clears throat> okay. I'm going to take the village action. Action! I'm going to get another follower. Mm, predictable. And I get a. Um, so I get him in there. And then I also get to take a cog. And I will be yeah. placing it after his turn is over. I am going to get a castle. It's woman. over. It's over. Did you say castle woman? Castleman? Oh, castleman. Could castle be a woman. castle woman. Why not? How about a castle person? She has to be wearing completely unrealistic uh, armor, though, with high heels. Yes, very, <laughs> very exposed armor. Yes, so. yes. Not protected at all. <laughs> me? Um. Yes. I so now the... I have the ability to draw to five because I got a castle. You do. Uh, You're so cool. I'm going man. to do the university because I'm so scholarly. So scholarly. I will go two spaces ahead. Oh. Farmer. So I get a farmer. This goes up and I get a fleet. All right. So we resolve the event. Harvest. Oh, I'm paying my fleet. It was just one, right? Yep. And this goes out of the game. Where's yes, it does. Time? I don't know. Where's the extras? I just chucked them in the box. Oh. Randy and I are very different people. He's like, hmm. let me put it back in his resource bag. I'm Unless like, I, I just throw them in the box. That's funny. All right, so we both mm. paid a good, so therefore we don't have to do anything. Okay. Pass the first player token. Oh, no, no, no. Reveal the next hourglass token. Bon voyage. So this one is, if you oh. prefer, if you want to, I should say, you can spend two coins at the end of this round to move your um, person yeah. one space. I like 
Okay. Oh, you know what? I have an extra thing. Where's... Oh, that's for Orleans. I need to go out. Oh, my gosh. What am I thinking right now? Okay. I got some stuff to do. Got One, some two, stuff three, to do. Four. Excellent. Excellent. Those are not what I want, but I can put them over there. I'll go here. Oh, ho, 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 oh. TV thing. What? Did you just draw, draw another one? No, I drew four. So you had two, you yep. had two things over there? Yep. Right. <laughs> um, this shouldn't be that bad. You're right, it shouldn't. Um, Wagon train. Yes. Right. Okay, I'm going first. So village. 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 Where are you going? Where am I going? I'm going to take a uh, craftsman. That's none of my business. Hello, some random dude. Oh, Rando's here? Uh, does anyone have a preferred player color? Pink. Um, yes, orange. Go. And then a purple, and then a blue of some color. Pink and orange, that's our, that's our logo. Yeah, Ellen, it is. It is. All right, I'm going to take the shipping action. I'm going to ship myself okay. down to Biare or Biare. Hmm. So for that one. Oh. Okay. I will wagon train it up, bro. Wagon train. Choo, choo. Um. Um. What? Okay. Wagon. Wagon. Nice brocade. Thank you. And then, is that it? I will yeah. take the monstre. Monstre. Get myself a monk, which again is a wild macaque. Macaque. Oh, Melissa Macaque. Oh, one Pip Wonder. Hi. Hey. Yeah. I always talk to one. I was, I'm like, hey, Pip. Hey, Pip. On the nightly chats and whatnot, what have you. Isn't that going on right now? No, it it's over be. now. Oh. It's over. Which is it's why over. they're it's joining over. us now because they're watching it's the High Games now. Fire and Jason. Are you done, correct? Yeah. All right, so let's resolve the event. Would you like to spend two coins I... to bon voyage your way? Do I get to pick up stuff on the way? You sure do. Yes. Wah! Chilling with me, huh? All right, I'm going to spend two to go myself to San Sierra. Okay. San Sierra. Are you... In a way to deliver. Oh, great. He already made a delivery. I'm so excited for him. I'm so excited. And that gets replaced right away. And actually, these are really cool because they have an X. Did you already say all this? I didn't. Say yes, let me say it. Else. I get to say this rule. So they have this. Stop. The, <laughs> the place where you can deliver and get one of these cards for, for making a delivery of cheese or whatever. They actually have a little map. Oh, on Pip's the birthday card. today. Hey, happy, happy birthday. birthday. And there's a little X that shows where you need to go on the card. There, I said it. Is it my turn? I like black. I think black is oh, the color. Hi, Dean. Blue. Yeah, I like blue a lot. So, Ray, I'm going to reveal the next thing. Not Ready? Yet. Why? You have to place this. You have to pass the star player token to me. <laughs> now you can reveal. Crusade. You cannot get a castle guy. Cannot hire any castle wins. That's thanks. Okay. Oh, I have my cog. Oh, my gosh. What am I thinking? I don't know what you're thinking. Oh, I drew four craftsmen. That's lovely. Let's draw them craftsmen. That's not, a... That's not of her business. <laughs> oh, no, it's not. I think that's possibly a dumb thing, but we're going to find out. What am I supposed to do with three brown guys? Two, four, what a terrible five. draw. Oh, Randy, you're friendly. Seriously, there's like virtually nothing I can do with that. That's awesome. Our chat is some of the nicest people. And I do agree, I love Jonna's um, B G B segments. And your hair is gorgeous. Are you serious with your hair? Who? Jonna. Oh, she in the chat? Yeah. Oh, I didn't see. Talking about her hair. Whoa, She's Jonna. like a friggin' mermaid. A mermaid, you say? <laughs> 
What are you this doing? This is really terrible. I literally am going to be able to do one action this turn because I drew three brown beans. Oh, yes. I'm realizing that I don't have... Oh, my gosh. I don't have any whites. And that's, like, everything. And I can't get a castle guy. What am I supposed to do? I don't have a gray or a white. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Farm haze. Oh, so we both had good bad draws. I'm okay with that. <laughs> all right. That's all I'm doing. I guess that's all I can do. Okay, you're no. first. Go but for I it. I still have only four things in here, so it won't be maxed out next turn. Gosh. All right. I'm going to do the town hall action. That's crazy. I'm going to take oh, a... Oh, you are going there. A set of sand. That's cool. There you go. Yep. Farmhouse. Sweet. Uh, Done. Games of Fire. Yeah, the only expansion I play for this is this one. I'm kind of interested in inv invasion, but I don't know. From what I read, it doesn't sound like too terribly appealing to me. But you know, anyway. Um. Okay. I Melissa has been loving this. the role player universe. We will be playing Lockout or Lock, yeah, Lock, Lockup, lock Lockup. Up. We'll be playing Lockup <laughs> here shortly, and we're hopefully going to get Stan the Man to play with us on live on Tabletopia. And if you don't know who Stan the Man is, <laughs> huh. Stan Cordonsky. Yes, he uh, is the um, designer of Lockup and Rurik, which is he's kind of a on genius. Both of our top twenties, dude. Very he's very smart. And he's a very nice man. Very funny. It's very nice. He's just a, just a good guy. All right. Passing the yep. start player mm -hmm. token to you. Mm -hmm. We will reveal the new hourglass tile, which is Wedding. at the end of cool. this turn. We can immediately draw two out of our bag. Before we, like, draw up. Oh, because I didn't get my coin the last two times. Two times? Are you serious? Oh, and one time, because you would have you would have. Yeah, I, I equal. Well, nobody needs to know what happened there. Did you there. see what happened, everybody? <laughs> <All right. laughs> choo, 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 choo. <laughs> this is nice. It is nice. All right. Okay. That's fine. I have this is good. Infinite possibilities now. So, so. do I. I. Mine are better though. You're. You're yeah. never better. Um, better. Watch. Okay. Oh. <laughs> That's not my business. You know what? I don't have any kind of a strategy right now in my mind. The last game that we played together, I was like, I know exactly what I'm going to do. I did it. I nailed every turn. I felt like I did everything optimally. What? And I lost by like 30 points. Well, you can't have it all. Our kitchen table almost didn't make it. It almost ended up in the green pile. Oh, man. What shall I do? What shall I do? Oh, hold on now. Gosh, how can I get that? I don't know. Oh, this one. Doi. Doi. I don't know if I want that yet, do I? Yeah. What are you looking at? Yeah. All right. Turn. Um. Or whatever. Okay, yep. Me? Yeah. Okay. Sure. Villager. Man, three actions, huh? So am I. Yeah. This is so cool. I'll take a black dude. We'll go into here. Okay. Sift through these. We have to do the university action. So if we draw up again, I'm going to go one, two, three. Get another citizen. Oh, this one's so hard to pass up. I'm taking it again, the library. The library, you love that one. I know, I've gotten it every time. Your go. Because it's nice to just be like, you get a cog in there and you just place one guy and boom, you just two books on the um. But the children book track. The but the children love the books. I've got I've got a plan. Cheese, your turn. Yeah, just a second. I got it. I'm actually afraid having this many resources because there are some really scary tiles that's like taxation on your resources and it's mean. Oh, I okay. didn't I didn't want to take the cheese factory from that one. Wait, what did I do? I don't know. Or were you thinking of the one where you pay a cheese to go up books or money? Oh, I didn't do this action yet, that's why. No. Oh. Okay, my bad. Alright, so I did that. I'm now t Okay. Back back that up a little bit. There we go. So I did two different things on accident. So doing that. Now I'm doing the black I think your question let's see. There we go. 
Now we're on track. Okay. I have the... It's your, uh, your go. I know. You need to come help me with this. Can I help you, you with what? Oh, great. You have some really good ones. Yeah, I'm almost done calculating them. I literally go through those. I love you! What programs do you use for editing your videos and who does most of the editing? I'm looking to start my own videos with the kids. I think you're talking about us, but there's been a lot going on in chat, so I'm not sure if he's directly um, us. I use uh, Adobe Premiere. I already have a subscription to the Adobe Premiere suite for photography, so it's kind of just a natural program to use for me. Um, but yeah, I use Adobe Premiere for that. When we do our live streaming, we do like OBS, but yeah, I use Premiere. But honestly, you do not need Premiere. There's many programs out there that are cheaper. For instance, the Adobe Elements or Premiere Elements, I think it's called. Um, that's like perfectly capable of, of doing that. I'm drawing two for the wedding phase. Yeah, so we're involving the event. Yep. Okay. And then you are a start player. Thank you. We went from like singing as we pass up to just like. It's okay. <laughs> Uh, it's none of my business. This right. game has a cheap secret. Class the Star Player Token. All right. What is the new locale? Uh, oh. Or the new uh, event? It is Fishing Grounds. Okay. You will get, oh, you'll get the same amount of cash as whatever you are currently on in the blue section. Just in general? No, so like if you stay there, oh, so get you would get points. none, and I would get two. Cool. Okay. Is that cool? That's cool. So I do love that so much. Gosh, I really need to start doing something with my life. I would agree with that. Okay, that worked out lovely. You guys go over there. You guys go over there. It is really fun to push these around your board too. Like that's just a good feeling. Happy. You're a very pushy person, Lynn. Well, only when I really want the thing. Only when I really want the thing. <clears throat> That's none of her business. <laughs> uh, I didn't mean to do that. Well, hold up now. Oh, I want to get the final <clears throat> I don't have a brown, a brown man. Three of any of those? Is Shoot. this three of it? Like it could be Randy. Look, one, two, three. 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 Any combination of three. Okay. I just counted a lot. A lot. A lot. Um, a lot. A lot. A lot. A lot. All right. I have locked in my lyrics. I also have done such. Okay. And is your turn to go first? It is my turn. To it go really first. stresses me out when the other person goes first. I don't mm. know why. I'm going to... Because it doesn't really change much. It's just... Ship. There we go. Chez. Adequately lay, warm. Lay Chez. I will not be giving that uh, Amazon review, like, a five star. It's mm. fine. It's warmish. Like, okay. I can't imagine going any, you know, less hot than that. Table question. Is that topper a smooth surface, or does that we design have texture? It is completely smooth. Yeah, so it's it is an appearance only. I just realized I did something dumb, so I'm gonna get it over with because I'm embarrassed. I'm not, but I'm gonna go there. This game can be brutal, especially if you're if you don't have like coins to pay for stuff <clears> that you screw up on. Your turn. I moved along the shipping rail. I wish this was already lock up. <laughs> okay, fine, Nathan. Not oh, your that's game. Cool. I get it. Games. She played. Uh, one of my girls played Wingspan with me this weekend. She liked it. She heard you say. <laughs> she should play with me. That's amazing. Me? My girl? I love that. I'm glad she played with you. I'm going to get a another so craftsman. You're darn right, I am. Oh my gosh. Yep, they're almost blind. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> oh, what's happening here? Here we go. Oh. Um, I'm also going to get that. Get the last brown man? Yeah. All right. I actually don't think I was going to, and then all of a sudden I'm like, <laughs> I'm going to decide where to put that in a second. Sure. Probably should put it. I'm going to do the monstry. Am I though? Sure. Am I though? I don't know though. Oh my gosh, Randy, wait. Okay, monastery. I'm done. Does Oleon remind you any of Castle Bur Castles of Burgundy? Um, yeah. For me, it does because not because of the gameplay, the vibe. Oh, okay. The oh. vibe of the game, and I I'm think that's why I'm drawn monk. to it. 
And I'm going to grab a number two building. But nothing else. Like, it doesn't remind me. So I want to be a sheep farmer. That's the one you were looking for. Yep. So I'm going to do the cheese sheep strategy. I'm going to try this out. I don't have a strategy. Guys, tell me what my strategy should be. So I can gain a cheese and then turn that cheese into books, coins, or wool. 